what's going on YouTube so right now I'm just gonna show you guys how to easily remove backgrounds in procreate and right here is my logo for my clothing brand and business that I'm running now so I made this video because it's kind of hard to understand other people when you only do screen record so I'm gonna show you what to press so you just press this little squiggly line, I'm not sure what it's called, and have it on automatic. You put remove, and then you press the arrow on the top, and there you go. Now to do multiple colored things or things with like gradients, it's a little bit harder, but for the most part it, it works. Um, depending on how you have it set up and I'll show you right now an example of what I mean so you see right here it has these two little sections that aren't fully grabbed you can swipe to the right and you can see that it's starting to take more out but you don't want to do it too much because then it's going to pull things out that you don't really want to pull so some parts it's gonna do it to where it'll just select the whole thing but all you do when you do that is you go backwards you just go to the left you swipe to the left and it'll minimize how much you're pulling out so I will be doing more videos on this type of thing and um, like this is an example of what I was just talking about. You see I pressed the P on Perico and it only picked that small little section. So when you swipe it to the right, it'll start picking up more. And you can pick up multiple things and if you mess up, you just tap two fingers and it erases. So you can pick multiple things. Like this. And you simply press the arrow and now everything is out. And you can change the color, do whatever you want with it. Um, if you would like to check out my clothing brand, you can find me at pericodesign.com or perico underscore design at Instagram.